<clears throat> Top 10 reasons why the earth is flat. Number 1. If the earth was round, then all of the water would just flow to the bottom. This is clearly not true, therefore proving flat earth. Checkmate, scientist. Number 2. Imagine the earth was round. If we wanted to get to the other side of the globe, why can't we just dig a hole through the middle instead of flying around? It would save so much time, but we don't. You know why? It's because the earth is actually flat, and if the geologists dug down through the middle of a flat earth, they would just fall through the hole into space. Checkmate, globe tards. Number three. So according to these astronomers, the earth is round because of the gravity squashing it into a circle shape. This is apparently because gravity turns big things into spheres. So then why the fuck is your mom not a sphere? Checkmate astronomers. Number four. So apparently, gravity is what pulls things back down to Earth and it's what stops everything from floating off into space. So then how does the international International Space Station even stay in space? Gravity would just pull it back down. This is because gravity is an imaginary concept created by the government and NASA to further indoctrinate all you flat Earth non-believers. Checkmate government. Number five, imagine a globe Earth. Say you were somehow living on the side of the planet without falling off, of course. If you wanted to get from the top, if you wanted to get to the top, your car would have to drive off a massive hill. But there is no massive hill. My car can drive from Australia to Russia just fine. This proves that the Earth is flat. Checkmate, NASA. Number six, if the Earth was round, then its gravity would just pull the moon towards itself, and the moon would collide to the Earth. But the moon has not yet been pulled to Earth. Not only does this dip disprove gravity, it also disproves the existence of the moon. At least a round moon, as a round moon's gravity would apparently pull Earth to itself, causing a big collision. <laughs> Contrary to what the liberals tell you, the moon is actually a flat piece of paper with a picture of a giant rock printed onto it. It is held up with the classic invisible fishing wire trick. This brings me to my sub point. But Adrian, I hear you whine. That must mean the moon landing was really fake too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, shocking. My evidence is that the moon is not real, therefore they could not have even gone there in the first place. Think about it. You've never been there, so how can it be real? Checkmate, liberals. Number 7. So according to the Globetards, if the Earth was round, then that means that if I walked in a straight line for approximately 106.183333333 recurring days, assuming my average walking speed is around 5 kilometers per hour and I did not take any rest breaks, then I would reach the very same spot I had started my walk at. Of course, this cannot be true because I do not have the time to test it, but let us assume it was. That concept would also apply to anything else. So, if I was to shoot an arrow forward, then it should go all the way around the Earth and hit me in my back, piercing my internal organs and spinal cord, killing me instantly. But this is simply not true. If I shot an arrow, it will just fall down to the ground. Therefore, the Earth cannot be round. Checkmate, communists. <laughs> Number 9. Unless you are under the age of 2 or possess an IQ substantially below the measure considered average, in which case you should not be watching my videos, they are for the eyes of intelligent people only, you will know that a round object such as a ball will roll down a hill. Therefore, if I placed a ball at the top of a globe earth, then it would simply roll down until it falls into space. However, if I place a ball on the ground, it will simply remain stationary. If the earth was round, this would not be true, therefore disproving globe earth. Checkmate RSVC here. But in case you somehow still don't believe me, I have saved the best evidence for last. Number 10. I want you to pick up a ball, a sphere, or really anything round. Here I have this tennis ball. I want you to feel around it. It is the same temperature on all sides as, as you should clearly be able to tell. This means that if the earth was a ball, then it would be also be the same temperature on all sides. But this is clearly not true, as some people live in colder climates than others. Therefore, the earth cannot be round, or it would be the same temperature on all sides as indicated by our earlier experiment. Checkmate, SpaceX. I hope that you have enjoyed my educational video and as, as such being converted to a flat earth belief. If you are already anti-globe before watching this video, good job! If you are around earther before but this video has shown you the light and convinced you that the earth really is flat, congratulations! That means that this video has reached one more person. If you are still a glober, well, it's not too late. You need to surround yourself with the truth before the indoctrination truly sets in. Head, head to www.flatearthsociety.com. Do not fall for the government's lies!